Hello everyone, today I am reviewing another metallic Wilburn Free Racer, and this one is Rip Klutchgonski. This version of Rip was actually not released in the 2012 Kmart, or I mean the 2012 Toys R Us uh, Race Around the World line. He is instead released a year later in 2013 in the Kmart Collector's Day event, along with Silver Cars 1 McQueen, and they were both released in the Kmart Collector's Day event in 2013. Whereas the other metallic World Grand Prix racers, like McQueen, Francesca Bernoulli, Jeff Corvette, Raul Cerule, Miguel Camino, and Nigel Gearsley, their metallic versions were released in the 2012 um, Toys R Us exclusive line, and it was a series called Race Around the World, and that series had the World Grand Prix race to metallic. And, yeah. And unfortunately, Mattel has not released a metallic Matt Chanel, Lewis Hamilton, Shoot to the Rogue, or Carlo Veloso. But they actually did have metallic versions for the Disney store. And the Micro Drippers line had a metallic Shoe and Max. And hopefully, Mattel will release the metallic Lewis, Carla, Shoe, and Max. It would be cool if they had metallic versions in the 155 scale line. Like if if there was a scavenger hunt series with metallic with metallic cars again, like they did in 2018, 2019, and 2020, yeah, a metallic Shoe, Lewis, Max, and Carla, I think would work well in the scavenger hunt metallic series if they're gonna do that series again and they should make more metallic cars for characters that hadn't had metallic versions before like wingo boots doc hudson Flo, fillmore and luigi and guido and holly shift well there's a lot of characters that really need metallic versions and it, it would be cool if the last four World Grand Prix races who hadn't had metallic versions yet should have metallic versions released. And yeah, it would be cool if they did that. So yeah, okay. Now let's review the metallic Rip Klitschkonski. As you can see, he has the metallic gold and the regular Rip has um the yellow color right here. The red and green are the same, and the wheel guards are the same. And he has the fenders. And he has gray rims, the same on the regular one. He has the same expression as the regular rip. And... This part in the middle right there is gold instead of yellow. And he has the green and red stripes, the silver circles, and you can see that he has the green part on the roof and green and red stripes right here that continue in the back. He has the um, black part and this black stripe and on here there's green and red on here and on here as well he has the world grand prix logo and the power by all in all logo those decals are the same on the regular rip along with the world grand prix number 10 emblem with the flag Republic of New Rindia, that is Rip's country, and Rip's country is actually fictional. All the other countries for the other World Grand Prix racers, their countries are real countries, but for Rip Kachkonski's country, New Rindia, it's actually a fictional country. So, yeah. Alright, and as you can see, the side right here, the sides are for some reason have this yellow color still, just like on the regular rip. And for some reason, it's not metallic gold, even though 
the middle part right here that's yellow is gold. So, for some reason, the yellow on the sides are not gold for some reason. But anyways, yeah, the decals are obviously the same on the other side. And he has the spoiler with the World Grand Prix logo, and there's green and red right here. And the back is pretty much the same. There's no differences. The exhaust pipes are the same. Spoiler the same. The fenders are the same. And the base right here. Similar to the regular rip base. And yeah, so here's a comparison with these two rip clutch gonskis. And yeah, that is all for today's review, and if you like this video, make sure to like, subscribe, and comment, and I'll see you on the review on Metallic Jeff Corvette. So this is all for this video, guys, so anyways guys, bye now.